There we go. <laughs> I was talking, but my OBS forgot which mic is my microphone. So none of y'all could hear what I was saying, but hello. It has been since the beginning of June, since the last time I streamed. And if you've been keeping up with me, my brain has been mush. A lot of things. I'm not going to go into it tonight. I just want to escape and live on a farm. Okay, y'all? That's all I want to do. Hello, Bowza. Hello, Eric. I just I just want to live on a farm. I don't want to do anything else. I just want to live on a farm. Okay? That's what I want to do. <laughs> Bowza, let's go farming? Yes, let's go farming. I've got my water. I've got a small Red Bull. I chose the smaller out of the two in the fridge. Um, let me check my levels here. Let me turn up the game a little bit so y'all can hear that more. Very chill evening tonight, y'all. I don't know how long I'm going to go. Um, but we'll see. I do have an early morning meeting. I roll. So <laughs> I'm not going to go too late. But I'm ready to escape to a farm. So what I'm saying is, you want to live on a farm. Yes, Eric. I just want to live on a farm. I want to live that cozy farm life that people say is not really cozy because it's actually hard work. Very true. But in, in, in a video game, it's very cozy. It's very simple. I'm just, I'm just ready to do the bare minimum. <laughs> and meet some people. And I bought Story of Seasons today, the new one. So I'm ready to go. I'm not even going to do a lot with the intro here. Because I don't want to go off onto tangents. So, I'm just getting into the game. Just getting into it. Just getting into it. Let me switch over. There we go. Let me make myself... Eh, I'll leave myself that small. And then let me switch to this. Nightbot is running. Streamlabs may or may not be running. Let me turn the desktop audio off. There we go. We only need sound coming from one thing, not two. Um, okay. That should be okay. That should be everything. Okay. All right. It wasn't chill here. Couldn't get home because the neighbor's Oh my goodness, Bowser. Neighbor's house was on fire. No one was hurt, but lots of excitement. Yeah, excitement is the understatement. Yeah, is your house okay? Na how far away is this neighbor? I'm assuming if you live out closest neighbor is like a quarter mile then your house should be fine, right? <laughs> I can't measure distance, y'all. My brain is fried. My brain is fried. Oh, oh, I meant to show really quickly back to the screen, hello. I meant to show some of the little extras that I got with the game. Um, it came with this little, this little goat guy, do the beauty guru thing, came with this little goat guy, little, little plushy that I will add to my collection on my desk. And then it came with this banner thing. And it's actually like cloth. It's not, um, it's not like paper. So I'm going to like... I'm gonna like use some binder clips and some nails and hang it up. I don't know if I'm gonna hang it up on this wall here or this wall that y'all can't see. Um, and then the game itself. Actually came with like a little booklet and I already read it at lunchtime today. So I am amply prepared. Ample prepared? I don't know. I'm prepared to live out my farming life. But let me switch back to the game again. This music is a bop. Okay, now I'm catch up on chat. We're fine, just had fire trucks in the way. I had to walk a half a mile to get to my house. Oh my gosh, Bowser. I'm glad y'all's house and everything's okay though. Yeah, I'm glad no one was hurt too, for sure. For sure. Um, let me find a different spot for this little goat guy. Get him out of the way. 
Um, if y'all are potentially caught up or have seen my socials, you know, things have been kind of hectic here recently. I won't get into it now. Um, I just want to focus on the farming thing, so if I don't address it, that is why. Well, let's get into it. I'm ready to- I'm ready to do my farming life. Ah! <laughs> yeah, Bowser, was it your fire breath that caused it? Let me turn this down on my side. I'll start it with a letter. Can't remember how many years it'd been since I got one. And don't tell. <laughs> oh no! My face is covering, hang on, my face is covering possibly all the words on the screen. Hopefully that's an okay spot. I'm going to move myself down a bit. Hopefully that's okay. That way y'all can see it as I'm saying it too. If I have to make myself smaller and back in the corner, actually, I'm just going to do that. Y'all don't care if I'm itty bitty over here, huh? Y'all don't mind. There we go. Okay, hopefully you can see all the words now. I like having both options on the screen. Me saying it and y'all seeing it. <clears throat> and let me know um, gaming volumes too, which should be okay. But y'all let me know if, I, if you want me to turn it up. I was trying to blow the smoke back to Canada and things got out of hand. Oh my god. Too much. Too much. It all started with a letter. Can't remember how many years it had been since I got one. See, I had this friend once. He used to share all of our hopes and dreams with each other. And the sender of this letter? His kid. Excuse me. The letter was all about life in the city. The kid asked a bunch of questions about farming and at the end wrote... I like to try working on the farm. <laughs> Sorry, I skipped that really quickly. To a city kid, I guess life in Forgotten Valley must have seemed appealing. It sounds appealing to me. That's why I'm doing this. Well, it took me by surprise, I'll say that much. I closed my eyes and saw my old friend smile, just like it was yesterday. A little background on me, I've never played a Story of Seasons game before, um, nor Harvest Moon. I played a very small amount of Harvest Moon um, since it's been added to NSO, but I've never played the original. It also was not that great to me. <laughs> But I only played, like, for an hour on the NSO uh, app. But I've definitely not played a uh, Story of Seasons. So this is my first one. Um, I've heard good things. I've been excited about it. I don't know why it's taken me lo this long to play one of these. It takes guts to travel all the way from the big city to the Forgotten Valley. A place, must, uh, a place most folks will forget about. Oh, face type. I was like, what is happening here? Ooh. These are kind of cute. What do I look like, y'all? I don't think I'm that cutesy. I like the idea of eyelashes, though. I'm leaning towards this one. It's either this one or this one. What do we think? Are my eyes that big? Uh, oh, no, no. <laughs> Number four? Okay, cool. <laughs> um, I am soups pale. I do like the color options that they give. I kind of wish they actually had a darker skin tone than that for some, some other people as well, but not too bad with the options. I'm going with the palest one. Um, I'm going to actually make... I'm gonna make it look kind of like me, but with green hair. <laughs> so let's stick with the brown eyes. But what does green look like? Ooh, green eyes are pretty though. Y'all know I love green. Um, my eyes are just kind of plain brown. Maybe I'll go with this like, more lighter brown. Okay. Uh, face skin to- uh, face? skin color 
and eye color can't be changed later. Are you sure? I am sure. And then all the hairstyles. This is going to take forever, y'all. Uh, I did realize that there's like essentially three different endings to this game. There's one ending that happens very quickly. Um, I will show you that. I won't show it to you, but I'll I'll show you where the option comes up where Ben ends the game. The other ending is if you don't get a significant other and get married within the first year, the game ends apparently according to the booklet. And then the third ending is, I guess, actually finding somebody and then going with that. So I think if you really want to prolong the amount of time you play the game, you probably have to settle down with somebody. What have I missed? Not a lot. <laughs> Not a lot, Ron. Not a lot. Welcome in. Uh, literally just making my character here. There's a lot of hairstyles. Can I actually... Oh, I can spin... My hair is kind of like this right now. Do we go with that? Do we go with this with like green? My hair used to be kind of like this until I chopped it all off. I kind of want to grow it out to this length eventually, which would be kind of cute. I'm leaning towards just how my hair is right now and that's actually pretty, pretty dang close. But let's look at all the other options here. Ooh, this is kind of cute too. I like the little little stick of hair at the top. The the messy bun. The braids. Ooh, little little piece in the front. I mean that's kinda cute too. Pigtails, of course. You all, there's always a pigtail style. And then um, the straight hair with the bangs, the full bang in the front, the full fringe. I think I'm gonna choose this. Get married or stop playing. <laughs> top right, just your suggestion. That's kind of what I'm leaning towards. Top right for you as well. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with that. But I am gonna go with green. Oh wait, did I even pick the, did I even choose it? No, I didn't, there it goes. Uh, I am gonna go with green, even though my hair is not green. I'm going with um, an altered version of me. So if I, if I could, if, you know, if green wasn't hard to keep up with, I would dye my whole head. Oh, two different options. Mm. Dog on a shirt with an apron and jeans and boots and gloves. Or we just go suspenders. I'm thinking suspenders. What do we think? What do we think? I like the dog t-shirt. What is throwing me off is the apron. I don't like the apron. I'm not a fan of the skirt over pants look. I kind of just want to go with this one. They both come with backpacks and this one also has a green backpack. Suspenders? Yeah, I'm leaning towards suspenders. This one has a green backpack. I'm kind of here for this. Alright, I'm going with this. I'm not going to second guess it. Uh, yes. Name, name, name. Of course. What else will my name be but Lockleth? Oh. I will have just enough characters. Oh my word. It's like this game was made for me. <laughs> it gives you exactly eight characters and that's the exact amount of my name. That was also, I think, my issue with um, Harvest Moon. It only gave you, it gave you less than eight. So I could only do L-O-C-K, I'm pretty sure. I have just enough characters. That is wild. Okay. Um, okay, cool. He, him, she, her, they, them. I'm going to go with she, her. Pronouns. Uh, you have to stick with your name and pronouns once you finalize them. Is that okay? Yes, I am good with that. Oh, we're so cute. Okay. Uh, so you're Lockleth, huh? Oh yeah, this is Takakura. He's also the one, apparently, that wrote the little booklet that's inside of the game. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I'm real sorry to hear about your old man. He was a good guy. I'm gonna make a lot of friends in the next life, I bet. 
I gotta say, though, you must take after him. No average youngin' would want to pick, pack up, and come to Forgotten Valley of all places. Well, once you spend a little time here, I'm sure you'll figure out if it's really the life you want. That man badly needs a better posture. He... Eric, I have that. I, I have bad posture. Just like that. I need to... That's a good reminder, y'all. Lean back. Lean back. Shoulders back. Don't hunch over as much. Can you still see me if I'm leaning? Yep, we're good. Okay, cool. Alright, this is it. The farm is beautiful. I have seen some people already, like, do the beginning parts of the game, so none of this will be a surprise for me. Um, but it just got me more excited to play it, you know? This is the land your old man and I found. The buildings are run down, sure, but you can still use them. Soil's fertile enough to grow crops on, too. See this pasture? If you spread some fertilizer on it, you'll have a place for your livestock to graze. Okay, I need to remember that. Fertilize the pasture. So how about it, kid? Ready to take over the farm? Okay, y'all. Here's the moment right here. This is the first way you can end the game right now without doing anything. If you say on second thought, if I chose this option, the credits would start rolling. Because <laughs> it's like, okay, nah, I don't want to farm. JK, never mind. I saw somebody, I can't remember who it was, um, pick this option just to see what would happen. And then the credits started rolling. So if you wanna, if you wanna speed run the game without doing anything, you do that, choose that. But I'm not gonna do that. I don't wanna go back and have to create my character all over again. So let's get started. Let's let's act like we're excited about it because we are. I wanna I wanna be a farmer. That's what I like to hear. I'm sure your old man's cheering you on too. Come on then, might as well give you the grand tour. This here is the barn. It's where you'll raise cows, horses, and sheep. I'll take you inside later. I'm liking the rustic look of everything. Mm, let me check something really quickly. Okay. Yeah. Volume level should be fine for y'all. Here's the shipping bin. Get to know it because it's going to be your best friend. If you've milked... If you've milked... If you've milk or... Oh, this guy's words are hard. If you have milk or any other products to ship, put them in there. I'll sell them for you at the city market the next morning. If there's something you want me to buy, write it down in the ledger here. Uh, buy? What does that mean? Over there is your storage shed and your food storage. If your bag ever starts getting too full, you can throw items you don't need in one of those. Okay. We like a good storage shed. I'll put the smaller items you buy and any profits you make here. Oh, okay. I bet that's what the ledger's for them. Other folks might leave gifts or rewards around here too, so keep an eye out for those. Ooh, I like gifts. I like gifts. This is the coop. You might have guessed, but this is where you'll raise your chickens. Pretty pretty standard. That is there one of your fields. You can plant seeds, but you'll need a hoe to plow the soil first. Speaking of which, I got a few packs of seeds and some basic tools for you. Try using them when you get a chance. Okay, we already got our tools. Sweet. <gasps> Do we get to choose our puppy? Uh, so I thought this one was coming to Game Pass, but apparently it's Friends of Mineral Town coming to Game Pass tomorrow. Yeah, there was, um, there's so many Story of Seasons games, honestly. I don't know, um, I feel like there was one that, maybe I'm thinking of something else. I feel like there was a Story of Seasons-like type of game that came out very recently, too. But it shouldn't, it probably wasn't Story of Seasons, and maybe it was that, that was a, the Game Pass um, announcement on the, one of the older ones. Uh, I think Mineral Town. I don't know if that one came, I guess that came after Pioneers of Olive Town then. Maybe that's in between 
Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. There's too many. Uh, I guess a couple of stray dogs settled here. It looks like they've already warmed up to you. All right, I'll let you keep one, but just one. I ain't a huge fan of dogs. <gasps> oh, now go on and pick a favorite. How do I pick? Pointy-eared or floppy-eared? Both of my dogs have floppy ears. So I think I'm going to pick the floppy-eared dog. Oh, but they're both so cute. I'm going to do the floppy one. Both my dogs have floppy ears. All right, then. You're going to need to give it a name. And I already know what its name is going to be. I will name it after one of my dogs. I would say her name. <laughs> But she'll come running. Um, I'm going to call her Luna. Sounds good. I'll try to find an owner for the other pup next time I head to the city. Okay. Alright. Guess I'll build the little one a doghouse too. Yeah, please. They need a home. And this is your house. I tried to fix it up a bit before you arrived, so you should be able to settle right in. Oh, my house? I, why do I care where he is? See that cabin over there? That's where I live. Oh, you live like right, right here. Like right next door. Well, that covers the main facilities. Ain't much, but if you save up, maybe you can expand some. And before I forget, I said we'd go to the barn later, didn't I? Well, it's later. <laughs> Follow me. I guess that's, uh, yeah, that's what later means. Yep. We already have a cow. I bought you a cow as a welcome present. Her feed bin is all set up over there. Oh, and she'll need a name too. Oh, we get to name the cow. Okay. Um, hmm. Name of a cow. I wasn't prepared to name the cow, y'all. Maybe I should have named the, uh, the dog Bruce. And the cow, Luna? Either way. Um, what should her name- what should the cow's name be? What should her name be? Morena? <laughs> Brayden, that's actually kind of funny. <laughs> or I guess you would say Moorena. Um, instead of like Marina. That actually... Oh, I have eight characters though again. So one, two, three, four, five, six. That's seven characters. It would fit. Um, I'm thinking Cowlith. <laughs> no, <laughs> that's a good one too, Eric. That's a good one too. It's too close to my name. No one else should be shall be a Leth but me, because <laughs> I are Lockleth. What should her name be, man? I know I'm going to have to name the farm, and I already have a name for that. Uh, do I have a name for that already? Maybe. I don't know. I forgot it now. It'll come to me later. Um, what should her... Man. I'm not prepared. Um, not me looking at my squishmallows. Lock cow. Not me looking at my squishmallows. What are their names? Um, hmm. Hmm. I do have a cow squishmallow, but I can't. I won't be able to reach it. Maybe I'll just. Oh, well, no. That's a boy cow. This is a girl cow because you milk it. Um, what would that name of that cow be? What is that one? It's like. Uh, cow squishmallows. Um, cow squishmallow names. Balana. Belozy. There is a lot of squishmallows. I think I have Balana. Yeah, that is Balana. One, two, three, four, five, six, six characters. Bessie. <laughs> I'm going to name her Balana because that's, that's the actual uh, squishmallow that I have up there. I'm going to name her Balana. I'm not like completely married to the name so if something happens to my cow let's let's hope that doesn't happen 
Um, I won't feel bad about it. If I named her Luna and something happened to her, I might be upset. Balana, huh? I like it. She's our first animal, so take good care of her. She gave birth about 10 days ago, so she'll produce plenty of milk as long as she's healthy. You should be able to milk her twice a day. Twice a day? Wow. Wow. Oh. She's adorable. Balana. I think that about sums up the farm. Ah, here we go. Gotta name the farm. Any ideas? Um... So it's going to be something farm. Everything is eight characters. Would, would this name even fit? <gasps> Maybe, okay. So solemn, which is what I just typed in there, is um, the name of one of my Animal Crossing islands that I finished. Um, but I remember now, I thought of solemn as naming the farm. And the second part of Solemn is it's spelt lime. And so I was like, well, maybe I'll name it Citrus Farm. And so I know you can have like fruit trees in the game. So let's name it Citrus Farm because you can have fruit trees. Citrus Farm, hmm, has a nice ring to it. Sure. <laughs> Doesn't sound too excited about that. <laughs> While I've got you, I might as well introduce you to the locals. I'm no social butterfly, but a youngin like you is sure to charm the heck out of them. Ready to go? I mean, yes, I'm ready to visit all the people. Uh, I don't want to pass on the intros. Let's go. Let's let's meet the peeps. Oh my goodness. All right, let's get to it. Yes, yes, please, please. How do I like it so far, Star? So far, not too bad. So far, not too bad. We're meeting the locals. There's my little green-haired character there. Um, this here is the lay, uh, the layover inn. Tay runs the place with his wife Lou. Their son Rock lives with them too. I think Rock is one of the ones you can romance. I'm not a fan of Rock. Plus the name Rock. Come on. Oh, and there's a girl named Nami who's staying up on the second floor, y'all. Nami's on the list. This fly. I have a fly buzzing around my head. So if I'm doing this, that is why. This is Gary and his wife, Nina. Oh, she's got a cute little ladybug hat. I like her style. They're lined up like you're, like you're trying to figure out which one the killer is. This is Chris. Okay. Nice, uh, nice Chanel outfit. Oh yeah, Star. A hundred percent. Nami's better than Rock, yeah. That's Chris's husband, Sully, and their son, Hugh. This is such a strange way to meet your neighbors, y'all. <laughs> Gavin here is the owner and head barista at the Bluebird Cafe. Molly helps him out part-time. Molly is also someone you can romance. I'm gonna turn it up a little on my side. Uh, Romana here owns the villa where she lives with her granddaughter Lumina. Lumina, you can also romance. Their butler over there is called Sebastian. <laughs> this fly is getting on my last nerves already. Oh yeah, it's not gonna show him, but this is a... Uh, Kind of a free-spirited guy that is also romanceable. Um, Gustafa. He's playing guitar behind a tree. He's a real character, always strumming some tune or another. Gustafa's on my list as well. That guy over there is Gordy, a man of few words, but a real passionate artist, apparently. He makes art out of metal. That's pretty, that's pretty cool. He's also romanceable, Cordy. And then I believe these two over here are as well. That's Vesta, she runs the agricultural farm, the lady on the right. And then Matthew is her little brother, romanceable. Cecilia, also romanceable, helps them both with the farm work. They sell seeds here, so take a look at their stock when you get a chance. Cecilia is like the one that you see in the trailer that marries the main character for the trailer. 
A few other folks live in that direction. This fly, I swear. We've got the twins who craft fireworks and an oddball scientist. Best not to ask about his experiments. Plus, there's an ar uh, archaeologist staying in a tent up by the waterfall there. He and his assistant dig up all sorts of weird stuff. All right, that should cover everyone. My goodness. I'm ready to do things. Star, did you end up buying the game? Are you, are you playing it? I'm sure you're exhausted. It's been a long day, so take it easy for now. I'm just exhausted in general, Takakura. If you think any of the other questions for me later, don't you hesitate to ask. Okie dokie. Oh yeah, there's something I forgot to give you. What? Oh, a camera. Camera belonged to your old man, ain't the newest model, but it does the job well enough. Let's try taking a test photo real quick. Why did I stand like that? <laughs> you can use it whenever you're feeling um, photographic. Okay. Cool, thanks. <laughs> now get some rest, kid. You've earned it. Yeah, please. Let me go to bed, please. Never seen a nature sprite like that before. Oh. I forgot about the little nature sprites. Jack. Hey, hey. <laughs> Who could it be? Beats the heck out of me. As far as I know, we're the only nature sprites in Forgotten Valley. Yeah, yeah. So what are we looking at then? Good question. Hey, buddy. What's your name? <laughs> Not the kneel down. Lockleth. Gotcha. So you're a nature sprite named Lockleth. Roger that. The little star. <laughs> the name's Ace. Nice to meet ya. Um, I'm Jack. Nice to greet ya. And my name's Hart. Let's all be friends, okay? Sure, why not? <laughs> I'm thinking about it, I'm not huge on romance and games, and this one's big on it. Yeah, that's true, but maybe I love the story of Seasons games. Uh, what are the other ones you've played, Star? This is my first one. This is my very first story of Seasons game. So I don't, I don't really have, oh my gosh, I, I literally go from barely walking to like zooming. I am running, running around. Yeah, I was telling everyone at the beginning, there's essentially like three different endings. Um, one where you can just decide not to do anything on the farm and the credits roll. The second one is if you don't marry within the first year, the credits roll. And then the third one is if you do marry someone, then you get to actually like play play the game. But yeah, the graphics look very good. Uh, daily Dairy. Feeding cows. Mmm... They eat fodder twice a day. Mm, mm, I don't care. We'll, we'll learn as we go. Let's go outside. Uh, before you go out, don't forget to check Takakura's notes. You can find them on your side table. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Fine, fine, fine. I already read the little booklet that Takakura wrote, so I feel like I'm already up to speed on what I need to do. But I guess I'll read some of these. I just saw you're alive. How are you doing? I'm 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 okay, Tyler. Um, didn't go into any details on you know all the stuff that's been going on, and all the stressors, of course. I just wanted to play and escape to a farm, so that's what we're doing. I picked up the game today, uh, the new Story Seasons game today, so I just wanted to jump into it. Plus, I've had some FOMO because I've seen other people already start playing it. Uh, I don't want to read any of this. I already know what to do. Let's go. The game came with a book, a booklet, so I feel like I already know. Oh, little Luna. I guess she'll come out eventually. She's just chilling. Oh yeah, I have the camera too. Let me fix, let me do, let me fix up some settings here. Gameplay. Mm. Control guide display. Uh, you can change the buttons, but I don't want to do that. Sounds. Let's turn. Let's turn that voice down a bit. That those little sounds are a little much. And let's turn that down just a smidge. Let's keep the let's keep the music. Eh, 
Leave it like that. Uh, return. No. Confirm. Okay. I guess I couldn't, I can't fix the touchiness of the controls. I can only change what button does what. So that's okay. Um, I think I've got, I'm pretty sure I have my tools already on me. Yeah, this is the chicken coop. Pioneers of Olive Town and Early Harvest Moon. I want to try Friends of Mineral Town. It's so highly rated. I, I don't know what's taking me so long to play a Story of Seasons game, but I've just never picked one up. And let me finish this real quick. Finish that, and then let me open. <laughs> let me get through all these sounds first. Let me open my water bottle so I don't have to do it as I'm, uh, Needing a drink. Oh, okay. <laughs> of course, no pressure at all. I hope everything gets better and this game does look chill. Yeah, I just want the chill vibes. Very nice since I've been crazy busy. Could use some chill. Mm -hmm. Well, you can leave me on in the background. You don't have to chat if you don't feel like it. Lurking is totally fine. Um, literally just going to get into it. Thanks, Star. Yeah, I went with the... We went with the hair that looks like my hair now, but we went with green hair. We went with, you know, just cutesy eyes. We went with the overalls outfit because I had a green backpack. And uh, brown eyes because I have brown eyes, so. That's what we ended up doing. Oh. Um, yeah, yeah. They're going to make me check these notes every time. I know what to do. I may not know how to get to my tools yet. Actually, I just figured it out. Um, I do have some seeds on me, right? Five tomato seeds. And one apple seed. And some fertilizer. Um, let's do... Let's do these tomato seeds. Use. Look at that. We're going to be a pro at this. Green hair confirmed. Every game has green hair. Has to. It is my hair color of choice. Uh, is that four? That is four. And then what? There was one apple seed. Let's put the apple seed or apple tree on its own over here. Um, pretty simple controls. This little sidestep that I'm doing. <laughs> Have fun on the farm. Need to go finish up a review? No worries, Eric. Thank you for stopping in. Thank you for stopping by. No problem. Have a... Uh, good luck on your review. I'm not sure what kind of review you're doing, but good luck on that. Ugh. Can we just sit and look at the, like, cherry blossom trees? So pretty. The texture on my hair actually looks kind of cool. Alright, we've got our things. Our things planted. Let's go, let's go check on Balana, our cow. Uh, I don't want to care. <laughs> I'm not reading it. We're gonna figure it out. <laughs> I don't want to read anything. My brain can't comprehend it and read things. Oh, we can snuggle her. Cute. If you need anything, let me or Seth know. <laughs> Will do. <laughs> Wait, what review are you doing, Eric? <laughs> I want to know now. Wait, can I milk you while you're laying? Okay. Sweet. We have milk. Um, they did say fertilize the field, right? Can I use this to fertilize outside? She's got water. Can I use this to fer- I can! I can use this to fertilize the field. What is this? 
A trough? A trough? Trough? Trough. A trough? Look at- oh! Okay, well, I'm never gonna use fertilizer on my own crops. I'm gonna use it for out here. Let's go, um... Let's send her out here, can I? Yes. Please. Can we see her out here? Is she gonna be out here? <gasps> oh, there's some grass over here. So she's got some food right here. And then, um, she'll have some more. Oh, AEW! Gotcha! I haven't watched your, uh, video on that yet, Eric. Didn't you already... Didn't you already play it? For All In? I'm, like, keeping you from your review now by asking you all these questions. Um, you can ignore me. <laughs> Alright, well, let's leave Balana alone. Let's leave her be. To do her thing. I'm pretty sure I can... Yep. You can hop over the fence, y'all. Look at this. No need for gates. We just hop in fences up in here. Uh, let's sell our milk. Move all. Yep. Let's do that before I forget. And let's go meet some people. Let's go meet some of the romanceable people in town. Let's just meet everybody. Let's meet everyone. Oh, we already have a cutscene. With, uh, Molly? Is that her name? Hello? Why are you wearing heels? Out in... Forgotten Valley. Very dressed up. Hello there! <laughs> Since- Hello there! <laughs> Since you're here, do you have time for a quick chat? I did a preview video, but we're doing a full review this Saturday. I've always been a huge wrestling fan. My husband's been watching the, like, the old school, is it WWE wrestling? WWC? WCW? I don't, I don't know. I never watched, um, the older wrestling. We, I've only watched, uh, UFC fighting. But I won't keep you from your full review, Eric. Good luck. I just adore this view. It also, it always helps me settle down. The rushing water, the gentle breeze. You just don't get this in the city. That is true. That's true. Oh, I'm so cute. That's where I used to live, you know. But some things went sour and I ended up moving to Forgotten Valley. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I don't say anything, I'm just deep in thought. Every once in a while, when I'm staring out in the river, I think back on all my old heartache. Hee <laughs> hee, just kidding. The clean air in the valley has done wonders for my skin, so I like to make sure I spend some time outside every day. Here, see for yourself. Thank you, Lockleth. You're such a sweetheart. We really should get to know each other better. I feel like you and I are on the same wavelength. I mean, we can be BFFs. I don't mind. Until next time, then. Alright, Molly. You're cute, but those heels make my feet hurt. <laughs> those heels make my feet hurt. Um, oh yeah, there's a yurt over here. I think, uh, I think that one guy lives over here. Where is he? Oh, here's, um, I'm gonna forget all of their names. Here's the metal art guy. What is his name again? I forget. Hello? There he is. Gordy. Yo, you're that farmer, right? The name's Gordy. I make art out of metal. Well... Alright, that was a short, uh, convo. Nice to meet you. Let's look for more people. This is where he makes his art. Nice. What equipment does he use to, like, bend metal? Did he also make his house? I have so many questions. So many questions and no one's gonna answer. Let's see. Uh, oh yeah, let me check my bag. Do I have a map? Mm, no requests. Citrus farm. Oh, we've got a lot of gold right now. Expenses income. Oh no. Income and expenses. Ugh, I don't even do this in real life. 
barn. We have one cow, I guess. Oh yeah, there we go. Her health. Interesting. We gotta gain her trust too. And then here's all the people. Okay, cool. This is what I wanted to look at. So Cecilia, Molly, uh, Lumina, Matthew, Rock, Gordy, and he's not on here yet. I guess I have to meet him. There's a couple people that are that are romanceable that they're not on here. And then here's Luna. Yeah, it only shows the people that uh, Takakura showed me, or, yeah, introduced me to earlier. I just saw your title about moving to a farm in this game. I was just thinking how much I love plants and stuff. I just harvested some herbs I grew. Oh, yeah. That does sound nice. I can't grow anything in real life. Hello. Sorry, I'm just barging into your house. Oh, Lockleth, is your farm doing well? If you ever end up with a diary... Diary? A dairy surplus, I'll gladly take any extra milk. Alright. You have a very athletic family. Look at all these trophies. She must stay in shape too. I'm excited to do some custom planter boxes. That sounds wonderful. Kind of jealous. I, I can't grow anything. <laughs> uh, no answer. Okay, yeah. I don't want to. I don't want to barge into people's houses, but at the same time, I want to meet everyone. Uh, is the cafe open? Yes. When you're feeling worn out, a nice, refreshing drink is just the thing to perk you up. Can I talk to you? Hello, sir. Hey there. Hope you'll swing on by and visit us at the Bluebird Cafe anytime you need some rest after a long day's work. Okay. Can I? I guess I can't buy anything right now. That's fine. That's fair. It's dandy. Do they grow their own, like, crops and coffee beans? <gasps> Here's one. Nami. Number one on my list so far. Well, one of my options. Everyone's in such a good mood when spring rolls around, but I don't get it. What's there to be excited about? Okay, Nami. You were on my list, but we'll, we'll see. Uh, there's Gordos, or Gordon. Gordo? Gordon? Whatever his name is. Gordon must be sleeping. Oh my goodness, what kind of science is this? I'm designing a like you shaped uh, design. I found some affordable automatic irrigation. Oh! Do tons of plants next year. I'm hyped. That sounds pretty legit. Do you help out with this? Life can be rough, but I think that's why people treasure the moments where they can be truly happy. I mean, that's pretty wise words. I should actually take that advice. <gasps> Here he is. Gustafa, I think is his name. Gustava, maybe. Looks like John Lennon from the Beatles. Gustafa. Now, where should I play my guitar? I don't know. But I'm liking your vibe, dude. I like the flower. It's giving, um, leaf from Animal Crossing vibes. I'm here for it. Ugh, here's rock. I'm not a fan of rock, y'all. You'll see why here in just a second. Okay, maybe not. He said something nice. Ah, spring. The perfect season for everything. Want to go chill out under the cherry blossoms sometime? I do, but can you not push me? There's a child. Hello? Child? Where's your mom? Hi. Oh, you're that person from the farm. I am, and I love your cute little bandage on your face. That is also something I would I would wear if I had the option in this game. <laughs> Makes you feel any better. My wife can't grow stuff either. She just picks them out and takes care of them. Well, your wife is a chef, so you do the growing and she does the, the cooking. And that sounds like y'all have a wonderful partnership in that. Uh, who am I meeting right now? Who's, who just said that? Wrong way, bud. Over here. Oh. Okay, now y'all will see why I don't like rock. Playing hooky from farm work to go for a stroll, huh? Lockleth, I see how it is. Hey, I'm just messing with you. Don't sweat it. You look like you were having a steering contest with the river, but I figured you were probably just overwor overworked or something. 
Not everyone gets this level of concern from a stud like me. By the way, just saying. He's full of himself, y'all. I'm not a fan. Anyways, listen, you have got to relax your shoulders. I've never seen anyone so tense in my life. If you don't take time to chill, life's gonna chew you up and spit you out. <laughs> Come on, let's hang out and shoot the breeze. Oh, I know that look. You're thinking, wow, this guy is so cool. I gotta know more about him, right? You read my mind. Well, first of all, thank you. I'm flattered, really. Second of all, you're in luck, because I'm happy to reintroduce myself as many times as you need. The name's Rock. I live at Layover Inn with my parents. Gotta be a good son and watch over him. You know how it is. Oh, but that's easy stuff. We gotta dig deeper. Let me tell you a few of my favorite things. Hope you're ready for this. Are y'all ready for- do you- do you know what he's gonna say? You won't be shocked. I'm all about taking it easy. No work, no pressure, no nothing. Just me, myself, and I live in the dream. Hmm. People do whatever they want in Forgotten Valley. That's what makes it awesome, you know? So you'd think all, an all-play, no-work lifestyle would be chill here, but everybody's got a problem with it. And I'm just like, why? Uh, <laughs> I want to be sarcastic and be like, that is pretty weird. <laughs> but, like, I don't, I don't want him to like me like that, so I'm going to be like, he doesn't... He who doesn't work, doesn't eat. Yeah, be mad about it. You need to- you can't just chill all the time. Oh, uh, come on, you're one of them. Everybody says work is so important, but I do not get it at all. Well, you do you. I'm gonna live my best life, and there's nothing anyone can do to stop me. Whatever, your name is Rock. <laughs> Clearly you're stationary for a reason with that name. Catch you around. Yeah, bye. <laughs> These games always have to have difficult characters. Yeah, apparently. Uh, I'm not sure how I feel about it. <gasps> here's the other little- here's a little guy. I forget his name. Hello? Pooey! I'm called Pooey, traveled- traveling to Cocoa Island very far away is a dream of mine. But to get there, my purse must jingle jangle very loudly. I traded many items of mine for coins, but still, it was not enough. You have the face of a good person. Yes, I can tell. Would you help your good friend Pooey's dream happen? Can I... can I help you? Okay, maybe I can't help him yet. I was gonna give him some coins. Um, oh yeah, I was headed this way until Rock interrupted me. Can I jump their fence too? I can. Hello? Now I'm just trespassing. Hello? Um... Here? Maybe? Heading to bed, have fun farming. Thanks for stopping in, Bowza. Enjoy your rest. Can I talk to you? Hello? Matthew. I like this place. Makes me feel like I've got a home away from home. Anyway, are you here to shop? Uh, sure. Then pick what you want. Um, okay. We'll grow from spring to autumn. Grows in all soil types. Grows quickly. We'll grow from spring to summer. Ooh, I like watermelons. Autumn to spring. We're in spring now, right? Yeah. So maybe summer to autumn. Summer to winter. Let me cancel. Uh, yeah, for now. Oh yeah, we're in spring. Okay. I thought we were in spring. Let me buy some... Let me buy some strawberries. Let's do another five. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, not yet. I'm gonna get some watermelons too. Why not? Oh, no, not that many. I'm just gonna do five again. Alright, that's plenty. That's plenty of crops to take care of. Uh, yes. Oh, can I buy fertilizer off of you? 
Not me being like, wait, one more thing. Wait, one more thing. Hold on, one more thing. Um, I can. I can't do math, so how much would that be? Oh, okay, sure. Yeah. Because if I buy fertilizer, that's what I can use in the pasture for my cow. Okay. Buying bulk fertilizer? Yep, you're on the list now. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I didn't buy potatoes because I don't need to make um, batteries. <laughs> Hello, Cecilia. It's such a joy to see all the flowers and plants reinvigorating this time of year. Very true. Um, where's the other woman that lives here? Aha. Uh -huh. You. Vesta. Hey there, how's farm life treating you? If you ever need a, any crop seeds, come find me. I'm more than happy to share the extras we have. Anyway, if you grow crops, you'll want to ship them out to the city. Just don't steal away my clientele, alright? So you looking to buy something? Uh, no, I already bought everything from Matthew, but thank you. All right. Oh. We just met Cecilia, but I guess we're going to meet her again. Hi there, Lockleth. Raising crops takes a lot of time and effort, doesn't it? Still, it's always so, so worth it to see those cute thing, cute little seeds you cared for grow and thrive into the most delicious fruits and veg. How has farming been? Is, is field work growing on you, perhaps? I don't mind it. It's kind of fun. Oh, I'm so pleased to hear that. I thought I was about to cough. Personally, I felt that whenever I care for crops, the little darlings are cheering me on and giving me the energy to get through the day. I'm sure I sound a bit odd for saying so, but working with crops makes me very happy. I love every second of it. Did I just say no? I was like, no. I don't... Can't relate. I just started, like, yeah, like today. Ooh. What is that? A goddess drop flower? And... An aromatic herb. Kind of liking these goddess flowers. Maybe I can give them to people? You can gift, um, people things, too. Can I pick up a rock? No. All right, let's move on. Let's, let's, I just want to meet all of the people. Oh. It might be nice to visit one of the faraway towns across the pass. For change of pace, the trip should take about six hours. Not right now. I don't even know what time it is. Oh yeah, no. We do not have time for that. Nope, nope, nope. No time. It is already 3.30. And a toy flower. Interesting. Okay. Wow, you really can just run anywhere. Um, where have I not been? Oh, here's that little... Here's Pooey. Pooey. Can I give you money now, Pooey? Now that you're settled? Um, yes. I'll give you 50 Gs. Why not? Sure. I'll be nice. Lockleth is a generous friend. Yes, yes. May our friendship never end. How generous. How very, very generous. Many thanks. I hope you will come back again. Coco Island is so close and yet so far away. No worries, Pooey. Oh, here's um, here's these old these old folks. Let's meet them and then I'm gonna read the, the board over here. What? Who are you? Oh, Lockleth, right? The one Takakura mentioned. My wife Nina and I used to live in the city, but once we started getting on in years, we decided to move out here for a change of pace. This is exactly why I'm here, Gary. It's exactly why I'm here. Oh, man, for an old man, you really have the strength to push somebody. Oh, you're that new farmer, aren't you? I love your pants and your hat and your sweater vest. Come on. My husband Gary and I are getting on in years. You see, so we've decided to savor the time we have left by staying here in Forgotten Valley. Well, I am glad to hear that. Um, are there things already to do on the board? Uh, making a tomato salad. Ooh. 
Hi, I'd like tomatoes to make salad with. Most of the ones on the farm are for clients, so I can't ask Vesta for any. She needs any tomato for one? Uh, milky soup? Yuck. <laughs> She'll give me eggs. So you don't... Oh. Oh. Oh, and I learned a recipe for milky soup. Okay, cool. I can learn recipes by reading the board. Interesting. Um, is this the layover inn? It is. Ah, oh, you're the new farmer that moved in, aren't you, Lockleth, right? How's life in Forgotten Valley been treating you? You know, I myself ended up here after traveling all over the world, and before I knew it, I was running the inn. Interesting. Hello again, uh, Chris. I'm fond of this place. Are you a fan too? I'm, I'm, I guess so. Can I go upstairs? Nope. I can see things, but I can't do anything. Alright, well, let me... Oh. oh, kitchen. I was like, I know there's a lady here, too. How are things with you? Getting used to work yet? If you ask me, it's best to go your own speed. No need to rush things. Okay, Lou. Hello, M Molly again. I like that the townsfolk actually, like, go inside of the places and... It makes it very, um, lively. Is this guy awake now, the scientist? Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, you are terrifying, sir. My research focuses primarily on energy efficiency. A fascinating topic, isn't it? Perhaps I'll let you sit in one of the experiments. Oh. You are... This is nightmare fuel. Excuse me. No. No. That is terrifying. Okay. Let's, um... Let me check my bag really quickly. Did I ever find out if I have a map? Oh, here's a milky soup. Hmm. We have things to plant. Let's head back to the farm and plant the things. Oh, wait, there's, um... Oh, I forget her name. She lives in the, the, the villa, right? I'm pretty sure. Hello? Lumina. Ah, Lockleth, how do you do? Alright, Lumina. Well, it's getting late. I need to head back to my farm, which I forgot how to get there. Uh, no biggie. We'll get back. Safe and sound. Hello, Bree. Can't stay because I'm about to go to bed, but have a good stream. Thank you, Bree. No problems. No problems. Thank you for stopping in. Thank you for stopping by. Very chill vibes today. Um, I believe... Is it right here? Oh, okay, good. I was like, oh, where is my farm? Oh, she's sleepy. Let's call her back into the barn. Balana. Go back home. 6 p.m. All right. Can I, um, milk you one last time? Oh, JK. Uh, let's just snuggle her instead. <laughs> now I feel bad about it. Okay. Sorry. I think he was too tired. Sleepy? You and me both, yeah. I'm also sleepy. Um, well, she's too tired. I am not quite. And it's only 6.30, so let's let us uh, plant the strawberries, right? The strawberries and watermelons. I'm going to put the watermelons in the back. So I have a feeling they're going to kind of grow outward a bit. I have a system in my head, y'all. Strawberry seeds up here. Use up all the energy we have left. Oop. To plant all of these. I wonder when bedtime is. Where 
realizing I'm hunched over again, y'all. We're also going to see how many uses this has. It's got at least 15 uses or more. Um, ah, Luna's out. Hello, Lou. Look at her. Uh, not the how we're holding her. It looks fine to the side, but the front? That's a little problematic. <laughs> Look at the space. Look at the space. <laughs> Why, how are we doing that? Uh, let's train her. Let's do like a little beg. Let's do a little jump. Let's do a little paw. And a little spin. Cute. Let's pick her up one more time. And talk. Luna is in a pretty good mood. Well, I'm glad. Let's set her down. <laughs> Witchcraft. <laughs> Using the force, exactly. You look like an alien trying to pass as a human. Is this how I hold a small ca- Is this how I hold her? Oh, 9 p.m. I start getting tired. Okay. <laughs> is this- Is this how you hold? Is, is this how you hold dog? <laughs> Why did I have to hold her like that? <laughs> that was a little much. That was a little much. Uh, yes, let's go to sleep. <laughs> oh. Jump scare. Interesting. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Um, I want to know what the weather is going to be like. What? Hello? Oh, here's the weather. We've got clear skies as far as the eye can see. Not a single cloud. Okay. Your luck is good today. Eat a good meal and get some rest. The elderly might bring you some happiness. Okay. Uh, don't want to watch that. Okay. Cool. We got our we got our j our things. Is this Disney's Animal Valley Forest? Yes, McBeal. McBeal, look, we have a puppy. Uh, and her name is Luna. Look at her. Little precious. We match with our bandanas. <laughs> we match. How are my crops doing? Um, I guess the ones that I planted later on in the day won't start growing till tomorrow? Interesting. Let's, um, let's let out Balana to the pasture. Um, but we have to milk her first. <laughs> you know you enjoyed it. You know you enjoyed it. Snuggle her. Daily snuggle. And let's talk to her. She said she was in a pretty good mood and then looked upset for a second. Okay, let's, uh, let's milk ya. Come here, girl. Let's do the thing. And it's supposed to be... Why are you upset? Let's let you outside, maybe. Let's let you out. Oh. Please. My friend just got a pup called Luna. Border Collie. Very cute. That is cute. My dog's name is Luna McBeal. One of my dogs. So that's why I named her that. Are you gonna eat? Ah, <gasps> She's eating! I might have spooked her. I might have spooked her. Let's, um... Let's fertilize some more grass for her. I can't tell if she's sleepy or happy that I'm fertilizing. This would be a lot easier if I had... Oh, she's just gonna lay in the grass. Okay, cool. Teach their own. Whatevs. 
I feel uncomfy with you milking her, snuggling her, and repeating, you know you enjoy <laughs> Listen, she's a cow. That's what you're supposed to do. There you go. There you go, Balana. <laughs> there you go. Um, it says I have a recipe to make this milk thing. <gasps> Did you already eat? How do I feed you? She has a fluffy tail. She sure does. How do I feed you? What's in this? Oh, we have a fridge to put stuff in. And we've got this. Let's... I don't know what the aromatic herb can be for. I'm just gonna hang on to my... the stuff I have? How do I... Yeah, it's her bowl, but how do I... do I... do I feed her? What... what happens? <laughs> what flavor doggos do I have? I've got a... That's a strange way to phrase that, McVeal. I've got a boxer, a full-blood boxer. And, um... I think... I've, I've, you would call Luna... We just call her, like, a golden retriever mix. We don't, we're not sure what she is. She's just a mutt, basically. But she's adorable, of course. Uh, make by a recipe... Milky soup. Confirm. Make. Uh, I'm just gonna make one. I can't remember how many I need to make. Make this dish, yes. We're cooking. Y'all, we're cooking. We made milky soup. I'm supposed to eat every now and again, too. Um, what? Who needed this? Who is this for? One milky soup. We get watermelon seeds. Let's make ourselves a milky soup. Milky soup, is that a thing? Apparently. Apparently. It's the only it's the only recipe I have, McBeal. It's all I have. It's all I have. <laughs> I heated up milk. Milky soup. Yes, exactly, Star. I heated up milk. Let's eat it. What happens if what what does it do? It gave me a smidgen of energy. Alright, well we got one milky soup. Um, to go give Gordon? I love how dog people are like, oh yeah, they're a mix of this and this, and cat people are like, I found this by the dumpster. I think it's short-haired. That's basically it. Balana is loving the field, and I'm happy for her. Let's go give uh, Gordon his milky... his warm milk. That's basically it. Let's go give him his warm milk. I guess I have to give it straight to him. Gustav, are you here? <gasps> we get to see the yurt. Oh, he is straight chillin'. Hello. Hey there, take it easy, friend. Smells good, right? I've got some incense burning. I do like- actually, I do like the smell of incense. If I wasn't scared that I might burn down. <laughs> this is a rental house we're in. I don't wanna- I don't wanna jinx it. By burning some incense. Gustafa's on my list as well. He's, he is a vibe. He's all the vibes. I'm here for it. And that heated milk is making me nauseous. <laughs> Listen, warm milks puts you to sleep, right? Maybe he just- maybe he's just sleepy. Need something? Um, I'm here about your request. I've got your s milky soup. Now give me watermelon seeds. Here, have this as a thank you. Preach. Later. Peace out. Peace out, Gordy. Gordy? Why do I not remember his name out of everyone? I can't remember his. What is happening here? This looks like it's just an empty plot? What is this? It's locked. Okay. All right. Oh, we didn't visit the villa. Let's go visit the villa. Let's go visit the rich people's house. And what's her name lives up here. Oh, the little old lady is over here. Hello, Nina? Yeah, good morning. This time of year always makes- uh, always reminds me of when my husband and I first moved. The flowers were just as beautiful back then, too. Well, I'm happy to hear it, Nina. Happy for you. Everything's locked. I want to go in to everything. 
I want to see everything. Oh, they have cats. I can pick them up. I can pick them up with the force. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that force pickup. Can I go upstairs with the cat? Oh, snap. I can walk all over with the cat. Hello? I have kitty. I have a kitty. This villa cat is definitely adorable, but you can't take it outside with you. I'm not. Oh. I was pressing the wrong button. <laughs> I was like, I wasn't taking it outside. I'm gonna, put, I'm gonna bring both cats upstairs. Just because I can. <laughs> Hello? Oh, that one's asleep now. Oh, sorry. Oh, can I? There you go. Y'all have fun. Bye. <laughs> I love that her hat, hat is a ladybug, yes. Welcome, it's a pleasure to have you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, she's playing the piano. There's no way to handle a cat. I don't- I'm not- I don't have cats, McBeela. I just- I- I- I just li I don't live here in the villa, but I- I- I live here without cats. It's okay, the butler pushed me. He- he knew that I wasn't handling them correctly. Sebastian. Ah, you're the valley's newest resident, Lockleth, yes? Managing a farm is sure to be taxing, but I wish you success in your tra travels. For my part, I shall endeavor to serve Mistress Romana to the best of my ability. Well, you keep doing you, Sebastian. Where is, uh, where is your mistress? Where is she? Thank you, Sebastian. <laughs> Little Sebastian. Um, you can walk all the way around here. Hello? I was about to suggest taking the cat. It wouldn't let me take it outside. It kept telling me, no, no, don't do it. Not for you. Hello, Gary. You need a new hat, sir. Why are you wearing a hairnet? Hello. This time of year reminds me of when Nina and I first came here. The flowers were just as... Him and his wife only have the one... Chat. Is it because they're elderly and they don't remember that they've already told you that? No answer. Okay. I guess... Are people still sleeping? It's like noon. Can we do stuff at the cafe now? Is it not early enough? Oh wait, this isn't the cafe. <laughs> hey, welcome. Oh, ple pleasure to see you. Um, shaved ice piled high with honey. Oh, and I've even seen grilled frogs and grasshoppers. Hey, don't knock them till you tried them. Um, no thank you. I will knock them and not try them. Hello, rock. Ugh. I can't even with him. Hello, Gustafa. Very interesting name. Now, where should I play my guitar? Do you have anything else to say other than that? Uh, oh, there's little Pooey. Okay, so they all have their... They all have their routes. They all have their routes. She's about to go into the store, but I want to talk to her before she does. Hello? Hello? Oh, you have a very wide mouth. <laughs> Vesta, you look like you have many s gossips to say. <laughs> hey there, how are you doing? <laughs> if you're planting seeds in spring, tomatoes and watermelons are the way to go. Strawberries and potatoes are risky, but you can make them work. Oh no, I planted strawberries. I should have talked to her yesterday. Oh no. Oh no. Frog legs are yummy? Oh no. Speaking of oh no, I've eaten frogs and crickets not too bad. Like Beal, Tyler, and y'all thought soupy milk was making you sick? And that sounds disgusting. Y'all need to check yourselves. <laughs> Vesta puts more love and care into her crops than anyone I know. That's why all our produce tastes so good. Um, can I buy stuff from you? No, oh, I'm just here to chat. I don't- I don't- I don't wanna... 
Oh, yeah, sure. Yeah, I can buy stuff from you too then. Cool, cool, cool. Um, I just want more fertilizer. Get like 10 more. Yeah, ring me up. I'll just hold on to it this time since I fertilized the pasture already. All right. Uh, f fried frog legs mostly just taste like fried seafood. N no, I that's that's a hard pass. I used to work in France. I can season them pretty good. Snails not bad too. Lots of garlic. Y'all are making me ill. <laughs> Y'all are making me sick. <laughs> Disgusting. No, it's not. A snail? No. No, thank you. Frog legs? A forg? A frog? No. No. Pass. No, thank you. Y'all. Ew. Ew. <gasps> Can we go fishing? Ooh, let's go fishing. Not you talking about frog legs and making me want to go fishing. Let's go fishing. <laughs> Do I have a fishing rod? I do not. Can I... Can I fish? I can... I can run in the water. To a certain point. Can I fish, though? I want to fish. Um, whose boat is this? The world may never know. I guess I can't go fishing? That's sad. Or do I fish in a pond? Do I fish over here? Hello? Is fishing not an option? I guess not. Crickets are nice and crunchy like- No! No! McBeal. No. Also had bull- Okay. Now y'all are just getting ridiculous. Now you're just getting silly. Do I have a rod? I don't. Do I have a rod? I wasn't even paying attention to what that child just just said to me. Do I have a rod? I guess I don't. I've got a sickle, a hoe, a watering can, a milker, and a camera. Um, I bet there's something in my book, which I do not have on me, actually. Um... That would explain it to me. Oh, Nami? I need to find Nami and talk to her. Her and I are not on good terms. Rock and I are also not, but that's fine. Gustav and I are doing pretty good. Gordy doesn't like me? Why? I did your request. Who else hates me? Gordy like dislikes me the most. Luna loves me. Well, that's good. I have to talk to everyone every day, I bet. Rocky Mountain Oysters, anyone? Oysters aren't bad. I've had those. Like, um... Charred oysters, right? Oh, here's, um... What do you call it? One of the twins? Charlie, welcome to the valley. Name's Charlie. Crafter of the world's best fireworks. Don't confuse me with my brother Cole. His are only second best. Hello there, Lockleth. Did you come visit the twins as well? I guess so. Where's the other twin? Here he is. Hello there, I'm Cole. Second best crafter. <laughs> Great. Good to meet you. And just in case you were wondering, my twin brother Charlie's the best. At least both of them know their place. Don't get me started on what some people eat here in Autumn. No. Yeah. Like, keep it to yourself. I don't, I don't want to know, McBeal. I don't want to know. I don't care. I don't want to know. Y'all have some wild creatures. I don't want to know what y'all potentially eat over there. I don't talk much, but I'm not trying to be standoffish. I just don't know how to strike up a conversation. Oh, that's okay, Gordy. No problem. I just wanted to talk to you more because you apparently hate me. I need to find Nami. Where is she? 
Where would she be? She lives in the inn. But I saw her walking around earlier, uh, yesterday. Hmm. Can I buy a coffee? Did we find that out? Hey there, you are welcome. You looking to buy something? Oh, ready to order, yes. Ooh, yay, I want... Oh, a coffee's kind of expensive. Let's get a... On behalf of Citrus Farm, let's get a lemon soda. <laughs> Not the drink it all at once, Animal Crossing style. Okay, well, we did that. I still haven't found Nami. Maybe she's back at the hotel. There's Lou. Hello, Lou. Um. There's Molly. Oh, it's you, sweetheart. What's wrong, honey? Type t tough time at work? Uh, no, everything's fine. Phew, that's a relief. I wish I could say the same. Molly has things to unpack, y'all. <laughs> she has things to unpack. Ah, uh, where is Nami? I know she lives here. Where could she be? It's already... Almost six o'clock. Where is she? Hello? Where's my farm? Oh, I guess I should let... I'll let Balana back in. Oh! Takakura, what are you doing? What are you doing? Hello? If there's anything you're unsure about, I'm here to answer your questions. Some things are better learned by doing, though. Wouldn't hurt to wander around the valley and chat up some folks. That's what I've been doing. Mm. Oh. Wait. What did he say about grass? Oh man, I'm just like clearing out all of the dialogue here. Wash your cows, hold a brush, and use it when you're right next to him. Do I have to buy a brush too? Aw, she's happy. Let's let's bring her back in. It's getting late. Balana. Go back home. Grass will turn out fine. Oh! Oh no, we need to water! Our strawberries are doing okay, but our watermelons are not- Oh! Are not sprouting anything. Oh, I need more. Watch me just go into complete silence mode here in a minute. <laughs> just watering and, and doing things on the farm. Um, let's plant the rest of our watermelon seeds. I guess I'll plant- yeah, I'll do- well. I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's do this first. No, I did not mean to do it there. Or I could just do watermelon all around here. Sure. Why not? How long have I been? About an hour and a half? Okay. I was like, how long have I been streaming? I just realized what time it was. Oh, I miscounted. Dang it, now it's off. I'll have to buy... <laughs> I might have to buy another watermelon seed to finish... to finish off the plot here. Oh, 
All right, where is Luna? There she is. Oh, let's sell our milk. We can't sell everything else. Luna smells like sunshine. I love that. Uh, let's train you. Let's do all the trainings twice. All right. She's in a pretty good mood. Well, I'm glad. Let's set her down. Um, it's 8.40. What else can I do? Hmm. I never found Nami. Gordy still dislikes me for who knows what reason. Rock has one heart. Why? So does Molly. I didn't even really try with them. Tay likes me. I mean, it doesn't matter, but... Oh, I, I meant to go, um... Is there a map? There probably is. <laughs> Star, I don't, I don't want to... I keep not reading anything. Um, let's see... Journal. Oh, that's just saving. Um, cork board. Oh, it's just the picture I've got. Takakura's notes. Navigating. The valley ain't that big, but if you get lost, check your map. With it, you'll be able to see where everyone is. Where's the map? Hello? I can change my look. The map might show where the NPCs are. I can change my look, but I don't have uh, I don't have any other outfits to wear. Where's my map? How do I do that? How do I f how do I see where things are? Um Am I missing something? Maybe it's a button. <gasps> I can call my dog. Can I call her from inside? I don't think so. <gasps> I figured it out. I pressed every button. It's the um, it's the minus button on the Joy-Con, so it's the left uh, top, like above the little thing here. So that's it. Ah, so she's over here at Daryl's lab. That is very helpful. So instead of me running around wondering where is so and so, that's what I need to do. This is where I need to go. I was gonna go up here today and I forgot. The dig site, the forest way, the forest. So she's over here at Daryl's lab. Okay, well, it's like 9.30, so... Um, you know what? Let's go see if she's still there. I'm gonna push my luck. I'm gonna push my luck. Let's go see. Let's go see if she's still over there. What direction was his lab again? It was this way. Yeah, there it is. 
It says she's over here. Press your luck, no whammies. What? I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, now I'm getting si Now I'm tired. Ugh. Is she still... She probably went back home. Now, she, now she's in Gordy's yard. She's on, she's on the move. There she is. I found her. Haha. -ha. I found her. No, no, no. Um, can I give you something? Uh, I don't know if I can give you anything yet. Everyone's in such a good mood when spring rolls around, but I don't get it. What's there to be excited about? Listen. Here's a, here's a new phrase. The people here are warm and kind, but it's easy to tell they've all got struggles of their own. Very true. Well, if I am going to keep wandering around here, spring's the best season to do it. I might as well enjoy the view. Can I give you something? Maybe... Oh, here we go. Uh, show? Uh, you like those? They're pretty weird. How about this? <gasps> Is that plant from around here? You could probably whip up a decent meal with it. Okay, well, I know you don't like flowers. Oh, my girl's sleepy. She's got sleepy eyes. Okay, let's head back. Let's head back. Done enough, uh, enough things today. Am I heading in the right direction? I could check my map, but... Why do that when I could just... Wander? Okay, here we go. It's 11 p.m. Ah, ah, hurry. Luna's going home, she went to sleep. Balana is back in the... I put her away, didn't I? I'm pretty sure I did. Go to sleep, yes. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh, a pond. Oh, okay. It was a show called Press Your Luck on GSN. Oh, Game Show Network. And because I'm an old person, I used to watch that when I was little. Yeah, I've never seen that, Tyler. I was like, what are you talking about? There's a note from Takakura. Hope you're getting used to things here. Check my notes if you have any questions. Takakura. Uh, playing records. I left a record player in your house. Every job's a little easier when you've got good tune to whistle to. If you get your hands on any new records... Put them on the record player and you're all set. We've got a lot of music lovers in the valley. If you get along with them, they might give you an old record or two. Ooh, I gotta be friends with Gustafa. Oh yeah, I gotta check the calendar. Um, the more I practice. How to cook. You'll need an oven to cook certain recipes. You get the space for it, okay? Um, expand, deposits, oh, deliveries, I need to check that, oh, that's where my profits are, okay, don't want it to fill up, oh, geez, okay, I need to check that very, very soon, um, let's look at the calendar, what we got, Van's market day. Oh yeah, we gotta go visit the market. Van sells rare goods. He only sells it twice a season. So the seasons are very short in this game. There's only 10 days per season. I'm already on day three of spring. Um, but this van guy only sells twice a month or twice a season. So the third of every season and then the eighth, I guess? He'll buy any unneeded items. Okay, so I can sell some stuff to him too. So I might grab a bunch of stuff and sell it to him. So let's let's go do the things. Oh, I should have checked. Let me check the weather. Is it going to rain today? Um, low pressure system coming in. Expect mostly cloudy skies. 
Okay, mostly cloudy. Um, what is... Luck is good. Today's lucky item is wild grass. Okay. So let's go do this things in order here. Let's get this. Oh. Mm. What did I get? I think I just got money. I'm pretty sure that's all I got. Okay. Not sure. Not sure. Not sure. Ooh, our tomato plants are growing in. Everything looks fairly watered, so I will leave the things. Let's milk Balana. Ooh, lots of milk. And let's let her out before it starts raining. Okay, um, let's sell the milk I have and then let's do some... Okay, yay, okay, so the food bowl automatically fills up. So she just keeps eating it before I've noticed. Okay, good, I don't have to worry about feeding her. Thank goodness. I was scared that I needed to... Oh yeah, I can order things. Order feed. Can order. Bird feed. <gasps> Fodder. Fresh grassy scent. Huh, okay. Maybe I'll buy some of this. Just one. Order an animal? Oh. Oh. Expensive. Oh, look at this sheep. And you could pick um, what they look like. <gasps> look at this cow. Oh my gosh. I want a strawberry cow. And a star cow. I don't even know what that means. Oh, high quality star milk. Okay. I meant to sell stuff. That's what I came in here. Cows are way up your price range. Yeah, I've got a little ways to go. There's the doctor guy. Uh, I got a, I got a ways to go before I can buy anything. Uh, are you gonna go explore the valley if you want to know what kind of place it is? Takakura wrote a whole bunch about it. Jeez. Navigating. Chat with locals. Bulletin board. Weather. Um, if it starts raining, I gotta head back to the farm and let Bolana in, okay? Remind me. Mm. Ugh, Bluebird. I'm like quickly reading this, y'all. Oh, here we go. I need- I want to open up my own stall. Hmm, timing is key. You want to sell during the day when people aren't out and about. Dig site by the waterfall. If you help out the professor, he'll let you keep anything he doesn't need. Oh, fish in front of any body of water. The river, the spring. The turtle pond, the ocean. 
It wouldn't let me do it earlier. Does that mean I can do it now? Ever want to go to other towns? You can cross the mountain pass, but only during the daytime. Okay, well, let me meet you. Oh, goodness. Badock? Badock? Dr. Baddock? At your service, nice to meet you. You are terrifying. Terrifying. Hello, Matthew. Good morning. Good morning, Matthew. Hey, it's got to be the best season of the year. It's finally getting warmer out. I'm glad to hear it. I'm going to pick these flowers and then go sell them to Van. Because why not? It's He said he would buy anything. And Nami doesn't like these, so... If she doesn't like them... I don't need them. <laughs> I can just sell them. Great name. <laughs> Strange name. Baddock? Baddock? Hello, Vesta. Hey. Good morning. Oh yeah, you already told me that. Um, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, the, the... Where is... Oh, I have a map. I have a map, I have a map. Where is... Where do, where do the things get sold? Where is, where is Van? Where, where do you sell things? Hello? The plaza. It's right here. Uh, right. Right. Here? Hello? I thought he was here today. He's not here. It's... Is it too early? Hmm. I are confused. Confusion. Where else would he be? It didn't show him on the map either. Hmm. Interesting. The twins kind of freak me out. <laughs> Not gonna lie. They kind of freak me out a little bit. Yes, in The Shining. That's what they remind me of, too, Tyler. That is very- that is very true. Hello, Lou. What are you doing? Good morning. How are things? I'm off work today. Come and kick up your heels with me. I don't have time, Lou. I have things I must be doing. Like checking the board. Um... No new requests? Okay, fine. Where is Van? I want to buy his wares. Oh, there's a Cecilia. Well, hey, if it ain't Lockleth, who is talking to me? Hello? Oh, Vesta. Hello. <laughs> Been settling in okay? Yeah. Glad to hear it, but you've never worked on a farm before, right? That's gotta be tough. If you ever find yourself in trouble, be happy to lend a hand. Oh, let me go grab my brother Matt to pitch in, too. I've been teaching him the ins and outs of agriculture, so I hope you'll let us help you out. Get it? Matthew can help me, that's fine. Hey, Matt, come here. <laughs> oh, he's upset about it. 
What? I'm busy. It can wait. Just come here. Tch. Matthew got a tood. Here's the deal, little bro. If Lockleth is ever in a bind, you be sure to give her your full support, all right? What? Why? Because the valley's a hopping place with Lockleth around. And if she ended up packing her bags and leaving because she couldn't hack it, it'd be a crying shame. Hopping? I guess I've seen more people wandering around, maybe. Ugh, there you go with your prickly pear act again. <laughs> Whoa, wait just a gosh darn second. Oh, there's something I forgot to take care of. Afraid it's real urgent, so I gotta make like a fruit tree and leave. Huh? Exactly, what's happening? Sorry to cut and run, Lockless, if you'll excuse me. I'm counting on you, Matt. Is she trying to set us up? <laughs> hey, wait. Well, um... Hi. <laughs> Sorry about Vesta. She's not exactly the best listener. Well, I'm glad it doesn't bother you. <laughs> uh, so yeah. Man of few words. Anyway, what's up? Are you having trouble with your crops? Need any help? <laughs> I'm like, no. <laughs> oh, uh, good, good. Well, um, I've got work to do, so bye. <laughs> Did he ask Vesta to, to to get us alone? What is happening? <laughs> I am very confused. Oh, there's Nami. I'm still waiting on um what's his name to set up his shop. Oh. What is it with all these cutscenes? I beg your pardon. Or <laughs> uh, hello there. <laughs> Everyone's hitting me up today. Hello? Hello? You wouldn't happen to remember me from the other day, would you? I love your, like, bolo-esque handkerchief. Can you, um, can you see that building up there on the hill? The villa, I mean. Yes, I was up there creeping the other day. I'm very popular, Tyler. Yes, very popular. This is what happens when you just chat up all the locals. Like, three times in a row, apparently. I live there with my Aunt Romana and our butler, Sebastian. I know this. I moved to the valley when I was very young, so I've not been able to sit and chat with many people my own age. But then I heard you moved in, and I'd hope the two of us could get along. We can be friends, Lumina. In any case, I do hope we have another opportunity to chat sometime. Until then. That is two cutscenes in one day. Nami, can we have a cutscene? Hello? Excuse me. I see you're a morning person. Everyone's in such a good mood when spring rolls around, but I don't get it. What's there to be excited about? I'm gonna talk to you three times, because apparently that's the magic number. <laughs> oh. I didn't even click on it that time. Okay, where is... Where is this van person? I thought he was setting up somewhere. Am I misreading that? Turtle Pond, Yurt, Beach, Riverside, Ocean Hill View. This is the plaza, but he's not set up over here. I am... Vesta's farm? Is he making his way? I think he's making his way. Where's the farm? Hello? Where's the farm? Where are we at? I lost track. Oh, wait, no. That's not him. Hello? Oh, sorry. I'm, I'm getting dizzy myself. Okay. Oh, there, there he is. There he is. He just hasn't made his way yet. Man, he is real slow. It is like almost 11. Hello, sir. Good day. I am but a humble traveling salesman who wanders the world. I offer others the chance to own a number of rare and unique items. My wares will be available for purchase on the 3rd and 8th of every month, so please do drop by. I thought they were supposed to be available today. It's the 3rd. 
I'm gonna follow him. I'm following him. After I talk to Gustafa, because he's like right here. <laughs> Can we also have a cutscene? Hello? Hey there, friend. Top of the morning to you. Now, where should I play my guitar? Listen, play it anywhere. We're going to talk three times. There we go. We did our three time talk. Oh, you're out and about. Hey there, Lockleth. How's life treating you? Works all well and good, but you're free to come visit us at the cafe if you need a break. Okay, is Van set up yet? Hello? Oh my god. This guy is so slow. Sir. Set up already. I want to buy your wares. Are we going to watch this in real time? Good day to you, Forgotten Valley. I am open for business. Well, that's how we know he's here. Yes, come peruse my wares at your leisure. I am certain I have had all that you need. My god, finally. Welcome to my humble place of business. How may I be of service? I want to sell. I want to sell things. What do I have to offer? Um, an aromatic herb. Uh, toy flowers. I will sell you six of them. Actually, I'm just gonna sell all of them. I can pick more later. And all of- all, just all of the flowers. What? I hit the wrong button. <laughs> hit the wrong button. There we go. Sell. 460? I mean, they're free, technically. Um, I want to buy. What do you have? What do you have? The warrior wa vibes with this guy are strong. So true. What's up, Octo Rock? How are you? Hello, Hopple. Good morning. Top of the morning to you. Happy farming. Yes, happy farming indeed. We are on day three of spring so far. Has something piqued your fancy? Yes, I want to know what you're selling. <gasps> this is how I get a fishing rod. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes, you have yourself a deal. Give me a fishing rod. And I think he had a brush, too. Um, I want to buy him. He's got energy drinks. I can buy the other outfit, which I don't want. Oh, a thousand. Let's buy it. It'll make our it'll make our cow. It'll make our cow happy. It's all for the good of the cow. It's all for the good of Bellana, our cow. Um, no, I'm good. Jeez. Raise a tough bargain there, sir. Doing great, happy somebody's playing this gem. I've never this is my first uh, story of seasons. It's my first one. I'm excited to play it. I like it so far. I like that the farming part of it is kind of more light. So. Oh, I haven't met Carter. Greetings. You're the young in inheritor of the farm. My name is Carter. Pleasure to meet you. If you ever wish to lend a hand at the dig site, just say the word. Okay. So that's probably what he's doing. And this young lady I don't think I've met. Flora. You must be Lockleth, I take it. Well, I'm Flora. I'm an archaeologist. I help Professor Carter with the dig site. Okay, so they must be, I guess, setting it up? Not sure. Not sure. Is she romanceable? No. She is not. That's fine. That's fine. Did I play the original on GameCube? No, this is, yeah, this is my first one. The, um, I did play, because you know the, the, the Harvest Moon is now on NSO. I played it for like an hour, but that's as much as I've played a Harvest Moon or Story of Seasons game. Uh, let's get out our fishing rod. I want to fish. I want to fish. I'm 
I'm like holding my breath. Nothing's happening. Oh my god, wait! It's raining! It's raining! Oh no, it's raining! It's raining! It's raining! I gotta get back. I gotta let Bolana back in the- in the barn. Oh no! She hate- they don't like the- they don't like bad weather. I did read that in the manual. They don't like bad weather. It's just pure, pure cozy farming goodness? Yes. Ah, I gotta let her back in. She's gonna hate me. She hates it. Hello? Come on. Here we go. Run! Uh, yes. Ugh. Okay, good. She's back in there. Let's, uh, let's cheer her up by brushing her. <laughs> let's cheer her up by brushing her, maybe. Maybe that'll make her feel better. Get her a little clean. There we go. Happy. She's happy now. Okay, cool. <laughs> Good thing about the rain is it waters your crops. Yeah, that's true. I didn't water mine this morning because uh, they were still partially watered. My strawberries are looking good. Ooh, my apple tree is growing in too. And some of the watermelons are growing. Tomatoes are growing. Doing good so far. In Stardew, I leave the doors open all days. Oh, another cutscene? Who with now? Oh, yes, we get a Gustafa cutscene. Look at him in the rain. Take a picture of that. <laughs> this little flower hat. His fringe. <laughs> hey there, Lockleth. You know my name already, yeah? Haha, <laughs> right on. I'm Gustafa. <laughs> Did Takakura take you around for introductions your first day here? We didn't have much of a chance to chat that day, so I was hoping... We could change that. <laughs> Not us talking in the rain. Don't worry about skipping over me. As long as we get to know each other in the end, it's all good. <laughs> Feel free to stop by my place whenever. I've got a thing for music, so maybe we'll sing some songs together. Could be fun. Ugh. Y'all. I want music. I want mus I want more records. Now that I know I can get it from him, I want more records. Well, the wind's calling, so I'm off. Good luck on the farm. You have a good luck with your... Wonderful musical abilities. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fish right here. Cause why not? <laughs> I don't know what I was doing when I came out here, but I'm assuming I'm gonna feel when the bobber goes under. So far, oh, oh, okay. I get it, I get it, I get it. Okay, I have to be patient, just like in Animal Crossing, which I'm not very good at. <laughs> I am realizing what time it is, so when it gets close to the end of this day, I am going to end stream, I think. Oh, come on. Fishing's kind of hard. Oh, I caught it. Uh, a large wakasagi fish. Interesting. Is it always going to be the same type of fish? Catch some yummy frogs. Ew. Fishing ended up being one of my favorite parts of the game. It's a lot of patience. I just have to hit it at the right moment. Okay, same fish. Let's go to the beach and see what we get there. Here's, um, Flora. There's a lot of people at the beach. It's like raining. That's not a negative on the rest of the game. I just love fishing so much. Well, I am terrible with uh, fishing in Stardew, so I'm kind of glad that this is a little bit easier. Oh, nice tool you got there. I didn't mean to show her my tool. <laughs> I meant to just talk to her. Uh, do you like the ocean? I guess you could say that, yeah? 
Can we can we just talk normal? Okay, I guess I guess not. Oh, can we talk now that you're Nope, okay. What's up, Pooey? Um I'll give you I'll give you one gold. I, I bought a very expensive brush earlier. I'm sorry, Pooey, but I don't want to not give you something. I wish I had a meal of fish to eat. Whoa, all these people pushing me, please. Is that item for Pooey? Yes. Here you go. Enjoy your fish. I didn't cook it. But enjoy. Oh, she has nothing to say. Why am I sleepy, though? It's only 5 p.m. Is it because it's raining? It's making me sleepy? I don't know the answers to any of these questions. Just asking all the questions. Um, what else can I do? Do they ever set up the dig site? I don't think so. Let's see what, um... Brody, is it? Yeah, let's see what he's doing. Because he doesn't seem to like me very much, and I'm not sure why. All I do is talk to him. How are you? What's up? Okay, well... Apparently I'm really tired, so maybe I should just get back. Like, look how sleepy my eyes are. I'm so sleepy. I guess I'll head back. It's only, um, 5.50. Oh, I remember why. Oh, that will be all for today. Gracious patrons, apologies, but my shop must close now. I realize why I'm, I'm sleepy now. Um, I haven't eaten anything in a while. Uh, so yeah, your energy goes down. I forgot about that. Okay, that'll be something I need to get used to. Where the heck is my farm? Is it this way? Oh yeah, it's right here. I have a map, and I have yet to really use it. Ugh, I'll talk to you, Rock. Hello? Hmm. Yeah, whatever. Let's go cook this fish, maybe, and then eat it? Hello, little Luna. Adorable. Set you down and train you real quick? Oh. She went into her doghouse. I'll leave her to it. Let's, um, cook a fish. Uh, let's just choose ingredients. Soups? What can I make with a fish? <gasps> a failed dish. What happens if I eat it? Not- nothing really. But sure, yeah, I'll go to sleep. <laughs> I need proper food, apparently. Not fish soup. I gave myself food poisoning, yeah. Alright, let me, um, let me write in my journal, let me save. Let me go back to the title. <laughs> Yes, I saved, so we're good. Okay. There we go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's me, a failed fish. McBeal, you are a failed fish. You are that you are the failed fish that food poisoned me. But I am gonna end right here. Um it's like eleven thirty PM my time. I gotta get up kind of early. Uh just like an hour early. Uh, for a meeting in the morning. But thank you all for hanging out with me today. Um, I am going out of town this weekend. So 
I may bring this game with me and I may play some this weekend, so don't be mad at me if I play this game off stream. I didn't really plan on just playing this only on stream. I just really wanted to play the beginning part with y'all today. So we got through the first three days, which isn't too bad. Uh, but yeah, appreciate y'all just hanging out with me, escaping reality and, and starting a farm. Why not? Maybe this got you interested in playing it yourself. So, have a good night. Thanks for streaming. Thanks, Hopple. Thanks for being here. Thanks, Tyler, Star, Octorok, McBeal for being here. This game is cute. I've never played one before, but it's cool. Thanks for entertaining us, keeping me up. Too late for work tomorrow, same. I've kept myself up, Tyler. And on a school night. A school night of all days. Thanks, Lockleth Adios. <laughs> wow, bye everyone. Thanks for the hangs. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Appreciate y'all. I don't know um, the next time I stream. If you if you know, you know. Um, but yeah, I'm going away this weekend, and I'll, I'll talk to you when I talk to you. You'll know. I'll, I'll try to make a notice next time I stream ahead of time versus kind of spur of the moment was this whole thing tonight. But I appreciate y'all. Be good. Stay true. Whatever. I, I don't know how to end things. It's It's so awkward. But anyways, bye.